Hi everyone, this is Helen Giles, one of George, George Cow's course helpers, here to walk you through the Simplero app with some of the new updates it's had. So when you first open your Simplero app on your phone, once you've downloaded it, you'll see this screen. Click here for access to the George Cow courses you're enrolled in. One other note here is that if you click this menu, you'll see other stores. So if you uh, have bought a course from someone else in the world who uses Simplero as well, you'll be able to access any of them through this Simplero app. But for now, we're just focusing on George's courses. So pretty self-explanatory here. We're going to click in and then here you'll see all the George Cal courses that you're enrolled in. From this three bar menu, you can also see all of George George's courses. Um, so like this is just a full list of courses he's got. Um, so this is just other information, but the ones that you need are here in your courses. For this tutorial, I'm going to use the Biz Plan Authentic Business Planning here at the bottom. This course is great just to get on the same page as George as far as authentic business strategy and is highly recommended for anyone involved in this community with him. So when you first open the course section, you'll see all the different lessons here listed. Uh, and these get added to as the course happens over time if you are taking a live course. Uh, and you can see some of these have green check marks. Those are the ones that I have already watched and marked as complete. And then some still have this playback button. And those are the ones that still need to be watched. So that's a really great way to just keep track of where you are in the course and what you still want and need to do. So we're gonna click into authentic consistent creation. And then here you'll see the video as well as any additional information. Um, sometimes there are more videos and then all of the comments underneath. With the video itself, uh, you know, play, fast forward, rewind. Experience that I didn't know how to... And then you can also make the video go full screen by clicking the kind of square button. And then once you are full, full screen, it's down here at the bottom right and that'll take you back to the kind of overview of the lesson. The other thing to see here is this uh, triangle with a dotted line circle around it. This is how you change playback speed on the app. So you can make it go slower, you can make it go faster, whatever works for you and your needs. In the comments down below, this is one of the new updates that the app just uh, released, which is really exciting. So we can now comment through the app itself. So you'll see anybody that has commented and you'll see the like button here. Someone, there are two hearts to this one already. If you hold this down, that's how the other emojis pop up. So I'll add a heart. It's very similar to the Facebook app. Um, you can also reply and that'll reply to this comment specifically. If you don't want to reply to this comment specifically, you can hit cancel again, and then you're back just in the main section. As you scroll, you'll see this write a comment stays at the bottom as you scroll, and that's how you can add your own comment that's not responding to anyone's in particular. And you can just tap anywhere on the main screen to make that go away. When you are done with the full lesson, you've gotten all the content and information that you want, you can mark that as complete Yay, you did it. And then, oh, yeah, oh, that's okay. Um, and then automatically the very next lesson in order will load. If you click this back arrow over here, it'll take us back to the main list of videos. And now you'll be able to see authentic, consistent creation, which was looking like these now has that green check mark. So that shows that we've done it. Um, the only other thing I want to show you is that on these, let's say I go into this one, just random, uh, this arrow with the bar underneath it, you see it there as well as there, um, that means download. So that's something that you can do on the app for uh, watching, listening when you don't have access to internet, Wi-Fi, uh, you're going on a road trip and you don't want to use all your data, your cellular data, or you're you know going to need to be on airplane mode. You can click that, you'll see it loads the um, downloading button, and then you can go back out. And then from this main screen, this folder with the arrow, if you click that, it shows, 
probably needs to reload. It might take a second for it to appear, but this is where you'll see all the different, um, oh, it's in here, there we go. Uh, all the different lessons that you've downloaded. So you could download lessons before you leave somewhere and then have them on your mobile device so you're not eating your cellular data. Um, I think that's everything for me from the moment. I hope you enjoy the app and we so look forward to seeing you participate in all the places. Thanks again, everybody.